conservative new media viewers, we're here to react to the Cleveland Cavaliers defeating the New York Knicks tonight, 111-104. Game was broadcast nationally on ABC television. LeBron was the star of the game, 32 points, 5 rebounds, 10 assists. He had the pass for the dagger three-pointer from Kevin Love. You can thank Brandon Jennings for making this a game at all, and that's because late in the third quarter, early in the fourth quarter, Jennings heated up. He was overpowering the guy that was guarding him, who was mostly K. Felder, and I want to talk about him in just a second. Jennings kind of went on his own roll. He had 11 out of 14 points in a 14-0 Knicks win, at Knicks uh, run, and if Jennings hadn't heated up, this would have been like a 20-point Cavs blowout. Now, getting back to Kay Felder, I, as uh, someone who watches the Cavs very closely this year, in addition to watching the Nets and Jeremy Lin, I'm keeping a close eye on Kay Felder because the Cavs are looking for a backup point guard that can play steadily. And I was reading something the other day basically saying that Kay Felder is now getting kind of a tryout period in the next week or two or thereabouts around the trading deadline to see what he can do. He did not play badly tonight. He actually had a pretty solid game, but then when Jennings got on that run, K. Felder could not contain him. K. Felder started to get a little wild, a little out of control, and that doesn't help his cause. Still keep your eye on the relatively short rookie because the Cavs are going to be giving him more of a look as they explore their options are they going to bring in Jordan Formore? Are they going to bring in, there's talk about Jose Calderon if he's bought out by the Lakers. But that's the quick wrap-up. Cavaliers get their third win of the season over the New York Knicks. Knicks just not quite in the same category as the Cleveland Cavaliers. That's all for now. Thanks for watching Conservative New Media. I am PFE Paul F. Villarreal, the NBA expert. Talk to you again later.